Hello and welcome to JB Movie Crafts. Let us learn today Administrative Management by Henry Fayol. Henry Fayol was born in Istanbul in 1841. When he was 19, he began working as an engineer at a large mining company in France. He then became the director of the mining company which employed more than 1000 people. In 1916, Henry Fayol gave 14 principles of general management titled in French as Administration Industrial at General. Fayol's 14 principles of management First, Division of Work The work in an organization must be divided among individuals and departments. Division of work leads to specialization. Second, authority and responsibility. As per him, authority should be equal to responsibility. When you assign, allocate responsibility simultaneously, you must give authority. Third, discipline. There is a need for discipline in an organization. In addition to obedience to rules and regulations, Discipline involves application and dedication on the part of employees. Unity of command is the fourth one. A subordinate should receive orders from only one supervisor. Command should come from one place or one site only. Fifth, unity of direction. The activities which have the same objective should be directed by only one manager using one plan. So direction should be one. Everybody should go in one direction only. Six, subordination of individual interest to general interest. The interest of one employee or a group of employees should not be preferred over the interest of an organization. So, the organization's interest should be on top. 7. Remuneration. Wages and sal salaries should be fair enough to cover the cost of living of the employees. The employees may not feel stressed for the cost of living while working. 8. Centralization. The balance between centralization and decentralization of decisions and policies, policies should be there. 9. Scalar chain. The line of command from top to bottom needs to be observed in usual conditions. Abnormally, the scalar chain can be sh short-circuited or broken. So, somebody in between may not lose the uh, information from top to bottom or bottom to top. 10. Order. This requires the orderly organization and placement of men, machines and other resources. 11. Equity. All members of the organization should be treated equally depending upon the performance and the environment. 12. Stability of tenure. The employees need time to learn and understand the job. The learning time is wasted if stability of tenure is less. If an employee leaves the job, the new employee needs time to learn and understand the job. So that time is crucial and that time means cost to the organization. 13. Initiative. Employees should be given freedom and should be encouraged to think new. Today, another word, intrapreneurship, includes initiative very much and that is must or that is much praised in today's environment. So, initiative taken by employees should be praised, encouraged and they must be given freedom to think that way, new way. 14. Espirit de Corps Unity is strength. Team spirit should be given importance. Please share and subscribe. JB Movie Crafts. Thank you.